So you're using the value mapper when you want to um, make changes to the value of your data of any field. So th these are the values, right? So for example, we want to change, I'm going to refer to these changes. We want to change the company name from Abernethy Group to Fubar. What we then can do, we can do two, we have to define the accessor and we can do this on two ways. We can do a pattern accessor and we can do company.name. So this is the first way. Then we can define a mapper and we can do, for example, the standard mapper. And then we can say we want to map it from Abernethy Group to Fubar, something like this. Then you have to select the comparator and um, yeah, then you can do the adaptive equals comparison and the adaptive equals comparison will only check for the value and not for the data type. So if one case you get a string and the other case you get an integer, but the value is exactly the same. So the value in both cases is for example, 10, then it would match it and overwrite it with, with whatever you put in here. If you do an equals comparison, then it will also check the data type. So if it's in one case, it's a string and the other case, it's an integer, then it will not match. So now when I press test, what we can also, also do, we can do a dictionary map there. So we can map multiple values at once. So for example, we can check if it's Abernethy group. So like uh, this, if it's Abernethy group, we want to make it foo. But if it's Abernethy group uh, 100, we want to make it bar. So now when I press test, we can see it became foo because the value is Abernethy group uh, just normal. But if I add 100, it will become bar. So we can define multiple mappings in the same value mapper. But what we can also do with, oh yeah, I, let me show you the second approach. So now I use this pattern accessor and I did company.name. So this dot notation allows you to go a level deeper. But we can also do the key accessor. But then we can say the root in this case would be company and the key would be name. And then we can see this also works because this was also mapped to bar. And if this is 100, Oh, without 100, it would be Kung Fu. So you can use either key accessor or the name accessor. Mm 